Hi, how's everything going? Is this good sound? <laughs> I'm Gabe Lawrence. I'm the VP of Cybersecurity here at Toyota Motor North America. At Toyota, we're really focused at building security in from the beginning in our products, uh, both in the vehicle and in the services that we offer around them. And building a good, solid cybersecurity team that can make that happen has been a key priority for us. Our businesses depend on technology more and more, and that creates much more opportunity for the bad guys to focus and interrupt things. We as defenders need to stay ahead of them and improve our skills and our response. When I started working here, one of the things I really wanted for the team was to have weekly hacking challenges. Um, and we started looking at building them ourselves, which was a lot of work. And I started playing with the Hack the Box platform that had lots of really interesting machines and labs. First myself, and then I decided that it was a great platform to help us have the team uh, be able to get that hands-on experience and that, that time together. Cloud security at Toyota is extremely important. It, it's the foundation for our connected car apps and our other critical applications. What we liked about Hack the Box is they take the cloud security training and they take the application security training and they combine the two. Why that matters is not many vendors out there provide both of these training. They just provide one or the other. They don't do it together. What's great about Hack the Box Black Sky Labs is they're able to provide that service to us and then be able to provide metrics behind the scenes. I was first introduced to Hack the Box by my management a year ago. The fact that it's a guided approach in learning, it's very helpful for the beginners to try to learn the fundamentals in cyber. We focus really heavily on creating an environment where our teams can learn and grow and improve their skills, as well as attracting new talent to our company. I'm the living experiment of Toyota's continuous improvement philosophy. Over the years, I've had several roles um, with different skills required. Toyota was able to support me uh, to learn up those foundational skills. We selected Hack the Box because it offered a large number of systems for people to experiment with, as well as offered a, a nice internal lab environment with scoring and ability to track people's progress through the system. It's even got interesting challenges for people who've been doing this stuff for a while. Uh, you can spend weeks on a machine trying to figure out how to get through it, and it's a, it's a lot of fun, even for someone who's been doing this for, for a long time. I was so excited, I sent Hack the Box an email telling them whoever put together the Academy is a genius. One of the challenges with self-paced training is making sure that you actually have the time to do it. I'm a busy person and, and carving out time on my schedule was a challenge. So I created Hack the Box Fridays for the team to get together and work on the challenges together and focus on actively exploiting these things and learning from each other and breaking the silos down across the cybersecurity team. It's more collaborative. It's less about, it helps the new people, it helps the more experienced people. We're there to help each other. We're breaking down silos. We're working across teams. And I find that that's, that's cybersecurity is the ultimate team sport. And this helps break down those silos to enable that. I have a really strong focus on the idea of purple teaming, which is where you combine the red team, which is sort of your adversarial team that, that tries to attack your environment, and your blue team, that's the defenders that are trying to protect things. Uh, using a tool like Hack the Box lets those two teams work together and learn from each other. And by increasing that, that skill set, it helps us increase the defense's capabilities of our company. Regular thing you hear during Hack the Box Fridays is, I didn't realize it worked that way. And by taking all of that knowledge, we've been able to secure our cloud and, and on-premise environments much better than we would have had people not had the opportunity to experiment with different kinds of problems. funny thing about the difference between like real hacking and movie hacking, right, is that 
real hacking is eight hours of nothing interesting followed by like 30 seconds of i got in i'm in and then movie hacking it's like two people on one keyboard going stop pulling plugs and lights flashing it, it having the group doing hack the box together gets you a little closer to that movie experience you actually lead the Friday afternoon competitions uh, within the organization. Yeah, it's actually my uh, personal getaway on Friday for the two hours. I really very much enjoy it. So don't schedule meetings at that time on my calendar. Uh, I'm really excited about Hack the Box. Uh, all kinds of new technologies and things are showing up there. And they gave me a t-shirt. <laughs>